In this question, we're asked to find dy by dx if y is equal to sine x over x. Now I'm going to use the quotient rule, and I've placed that over on the right-hand side just for easy reference. So we need to have u and v. So looking at this one here, we can let u equal sine x, and v will be equal to x. Now, if we differentiate this, we get du by dx is equal to cos x and dv by dx. Well, when we differentiate that, we just get 1. So dy by dx, we can now apply this rule here. So we need to have v times du by dx. So v is x, and we're multiplying that by cos x. Then we're going to subtract u times dv by dx, so these two multiplied, which will be simply sine x. Now that's all over v squared, and that would be x squared. Now we can actually simplify this a little bit. Uh, we write it as two separate fractions. We have x cos x over x squared minus sine x over x squared. If you notice, this x here will cancel with one of these, which will leave me with cos x over x minus sine x over x squared. If you found this lesson useful, then please give me a thumbs up, and in the comments section below, tell me which country you're from and what tutorials you would like to see in the future.